Dream Universe September Week 4. For the opener, we got House of Black, ranked number 5 in the tag division versus the Combat Club. Brian Danielson and John Moxley, ranked number 6. And then we got the rematch of Roderick Strong versus MJF. This time I have fixed their entrances. And they are accurate. Roderick Strong ranked number eight in the TNT title division versus MJF ranked number six. Uh, and this is, again, a rematch in the TNT division. MJF defeated Roderick Strong in his debut. At that time, MJF was ranked number eight and Strong was number seven. Now it's Strong who is eight and MJF is six. So a redemption match for Roderick Strong who's not too fond of Mr. MJF. In our third match, we have a another uh, tag division ranked match. The Nightmare Family on a two win streak, ranked number two in a tag division versus Los Ingo Bernables, ranked number one and this will be a number one contenders match in the tag division Adam Copeland still on a win streak at three wins in a row ranked number still ranked number six in the AEW title division what's going on here 2k he's won three in a row and he's still ranked number six in the AEW but that will change after this match, if it defeats uh, Adam Page, who is ranked number two, coming off a loss last week versus Darby Allen in the AEW title division. And in match number five, we have our... Let's see. Our second rival battle still with Eddie Kingston and both, both Eddie Kingston and Claudio playing mind games. Yet to uh, face each other for the second time uh, Eddie Kingston ranked number 3 in the international title division versus Claudio ranked number 6 in the international title division Claudio has one victory over Eddie Eddie was 0 but uh, Claudio went down a rank after losing to a uh, replacement sent by Eddie Kingston Claudio did the same two weeks ago to Eddie Kingston but Eddie Kingston defeated Claudio's replacement <clears throat> so that's why Claudio's ranked lower than uh, Eddie Kingston and this will be their second rival battle like I said last week <laughs> uh, this will be their official match but this time it's real I double checked okay in our main event we have the only title match of the night for the AEW World Title. Darby Allen ranked number one in the AEW title division versus Adam Cole. And Darby Allen coming off a win last week, defeating uh, Adam Page. Big win for Darby. And which moved him up to rank number one in the AEW title division and giving him a title shot tonight. All right, let's get this show started. And our first matchup is a ranked match in the tag division, of course. House of Black, ranked number five versus Combat Club, ranked number six. Better get ready.
The following is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Buddy Matthews at a combined weight of 500 pounds. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. Look who it is. And their opponents at a combined weight of 435 pounds. The club. As a former tag champ myself, I know when I see a championship caliber team, and this is the dictionary definition of one. The WWE Tag Team Division is more competitive than ever. As these two teams get into it, I can almost guarantee this match will be one to remember. The standards for tag team action just keep getting higher and higher around here. Top oh, oh, suplex. Ooh, a planted knee. Ouch. Great counter. There it is. Snap suplex. Big four. Returning fire. Ooh-wee. Oh, look at this. Out to the apron. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? Back suplex right out of the apron. Ah, oh, look at this. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Wrenching the arm. Driven all the way down for a European arm breaker. Into the barricade. Ooh, that hurt. Countered it just in time. The running Meteora. Caught with that four. Taking the easy way. And we're cutting it kind of close, don't you think? You could say that again. Time to get the let out. Wrenching the arm. Driven all the way. Dead. Will it be? Kick it out before the count. Wow, I thought this was over. Arm breaker. Partner tags in. Gotta respect the strategy to work over the arm. Crushing knee strike. Twists the arm and a kick right to the midsection. Reaches his partner for the tag. Whoa. And he tosses it back in now. to keep him down. Unbelievable athleticism. Ooh, what a nasty kick. That's disrespectful. He's absorbed some damage already. Face gouge. Oh, God. Forearm smash. 
Drop kick all the way to the floor. Caught with the boot. They've got their opponent's arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Just caught flush. Some control. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Wasting absolutely no respect on his opponent. You gotta love it. Solid punch. in the face on the canvas. And an elbow drop, too. Boom! Double team. A hip toss. And a kick to boot. Oof. Insult to injury. Modified cloverleaf applied. Oh, into a backbreaker. Painful. Now he's been put on the defensive. He switches it back around. Bang! Tag made. Tag of offense on the horizon here. The From the middle row. Oh, springboard moonsault! Uh-oh, here's the setup. Black mass! Good night. Is it enough? Is it enough? He must have had that scout. Set up in the corner of the ring. In full control here. Face first in the turnbuckle. Going up to the top. What are we going to see here? Dragon sleeper locked in. Oh. He's absorbing some tough hits now. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course, they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Turning the tables there. To the neck, neck breaker, and off the tag. at this point.
tags him in. He's in a precarious situation. Snap suplex. Very nice. Sure, he was done. The heart of these competitors is showing through tonight. The adrenaline is coursing through their veins. Suplex. Oh no. to 
delivered back into the ring. And now he's giving you all another chance to simply take it all in. their opponent further and here we are look at the angle it's nasty he has been here before and he knows what he needs to do and tag he did it let's go going up. he's got to know he's in harm's way here he's about to do it he's about to do it for the win. Oh! Come on, ref. Get some control. Shut up, Byron. And he sends him into the corner. Wicked close line. Close line. Oh, these debilitating forearm strikes. Good night. Just defenseless as the momentum is against him. Yeah, it's to pull out some form of offense here. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Here we go. Drop! Now he's been forced to take a breather. That last sequence didn't go as he planned. And he slides him back to the mat.
the Combat Club defeat the House of Black, but now, but not before, the House of Black gave him a five-star match. What an opener for tonight's card on AEW. Congrats to the Combat Club. They will keep pushing up the tag division ladder. <laughs> On to our second match, which is a rematch. A grudge rematch at, at that. Roderick Strong not taking his loss lightly versus MJF last week. MJF coming out with a victory. Roderick Strong asking for an immediate rematch. And we got Roderick Strong coming in at rank number eight in the TNT title division versus uh, MJF rank number six. Uh, but before last week, MJF was at number eight and Roderick Strong was at seven before uh, MJF's victory over Strong. So, of course, Strong won an immediate rematch. And this time, I got their entrances fixed because last week their entrances were not too accurate. Let's see what happens in the rematch. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 200 pounds, the superstar Roddy Strongman. Matches of this caliber with this level of talent showing their skills, this is why I do what I do. Okay, I don't know what's going on here. I, I could have swore I changed his entrance, him and both MJF. Hopefully MJF will not come out with the same entrance, but uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on here. And I forgot to mention that uh, the match between Strong and MJF was a four-star match last week. Let's see if they give us the same today. And his opponent from Long Island, New York, weighing in at 226 pounds, MJF. The WWE Universe is on their feet for this superstar. They are ready for unapologetic high-intensity action. I would be shocked if we saw apologetic in-ring action of any sort, Byron. He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. Some have called this superstar a bit too intense, and as we can already see from the look in his eyes, there's a reason why. In this business, intensity often breeds success. He is well aware of that. He's hoping that focus and drive really propel him to success. But he's going to be facing one superstar who's always evolving. He told me earlier that he's looking to showcase some new moves in this match tonight. Connects on the kick. Carefully measured knee drop. Has it hooked in? 
goodness, inverted suplex. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Yeah, the defects in his game are leaving him vulnerable. Perched up top. You gotta be kidding me. Just crashing down with high impact. He's got the answer for that one. He's trying to bring the fight back in this one. Oh, what a good buster. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Tossed into the corner. Close line in the corner. Continuing to work on the arm with a and a carefully measured knee drop. Saw that one coming. Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? The cross face chicken wing. He's got it locked in. He may not have a choice. He may have Delivers the oh, right there, elbow, and gets out of it. Look at this. Oh, backbreaker. Right to the spine. First on the second. Oh, no. Hey, it might be time for a change of strategy. His best move didn't get the job done. Rocked by the clothesline out of nowhere. This could be Superstar Roddy 
strong man. An important victory for him in this match. No doubt about it, support for this guy grows by the second in the estimation of the WWE Universe. So Roderick Strong gets his revenge on MJF. And of course, there will be a part three to this match. And that will be the tiebreaker come next week. And I promise you the entrances will be fixed. I think I know what happened. I went to uh, players uh, creation and edited the entrance from there instead of from the universe one. So I got to. Remind myself at the end of this show to go to universe mode and edit the entrance from there so it can work. Hopefully that's what it was. All right. On to match number three. And our second uh, tag division rank match. The Nightmare Family on a two-win streak. Rank number two versus the number one tag team in AEW in the division. Los Ingo Bernables, and this will be a number one contenders match in the tag division. The following is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 452 pounds. Ah! Cody Rhodes and Dustin Rhodes, the family. You are looking at a team that delivers a tag clinic every time they compete. But tonight might be their best ah! lesson yet. They're here. And their opponents at a combined weight of 449 pounds. Los Conquistadores. Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have wanted to call this match. I cannot wait to finally do it. There's the bell on this tag team match is now official. Two very talented teams here, but it takes more than just that to succeed as a tandem in WWE. You have to be completely in sync to rise to the top of this division. Swinging neck breaker. Punish 
challenging their opponent. Bobby blows. Pedro. Oh, what impact. Oh, that's going to hurt. Lions face first. Tag switching it up. Scouted with the Lariat. Oh, right suplex. Tagging his partner in now. Oh, back elbow. Script on him there. Reversal after reversal, proving they did their homework. The speed with that elbow was mind blowing. Oof. I don't know if this is a show of confidence. There's not much room out there. D D T face first. Oh my God. This is not going to end well. Nice suplex. Tagged in. And tag. He's in now. Finally. Yeah. Caught with a clothesline. Telegraph that one and delivers a blow to the gut. Here's the cover for the win. Still only got one. I can't believe it. He just won't go away.
still has a great amount of fight in them. Not going to let it end like that. And I think we just might see. Perfectly executed. Sent a message with that one. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Staring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Take off. He misses the target. Short flank, but a rough landing. Oh, 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 meet the backside of an elbow. Shoulders down. Kicks out after one. He's still got life in this matchup. Tag made here. These two work so well together. We're about to see an example why. Move! Oh, oh, oh! What a stop! Man, Cody looking to wrap this one up. Cody Rhodes hooks him up. Oh, he put his opponent on Dream Street. Crossroads. Rhodes just turned the lights on. Wow, looks like this book has a couple more chapters in it. We might be seeing a whole saga written tonight. Rhodes hooked for the three catch. Uh-oh. Way too long. Oh, 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 sit out slam. After what we've seen so far, you cannot pick. Uh-oh, this isn't going to end well for someone. Oh, The close of this match is just ahead. At this point, it might be too much for him to recover from, Cole. Big close line. 
The suspense this crowd is feeling is palpable. They are waiting with bated breath for what's to come next. Knew what was coming there. And he's asking for more. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. No surprise that what we're witnessing is trending. Forget trending on social media. The motion in the arena is charting on the Richter scale. Into the schoolboy way. That's not it. Suplex. And that's going to lower his chances as this match goes on. I think he's realizing the toll this match has taken on. Kick to the midsection into the hammerlock. I think we know what comes next. DDT! Now that is an exclamation point. Cover! Wait, 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 wait. How can that be fair? Come on, ref. Keep these guys in check. Kick to the midsection into the hammerlock. I think we know what comes next. DDT! Tuck him in. It's bedtime. Looking for the victory! Looking for a high risk. Reward situation. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Up high. Catches nothing but air. Ooh, sharp kick. He's in off the tag. Cody sparing some time for the adoring fans. Oh, man. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of flying. Comes down with this. Is it enough? The cover. And it's got to feel good. Sweet, sweet victory. Here are your winners. Dustin Rose and Cody Rose. The family. And the winners celebrate together. Great chemistry tonight. Tag team excellence in its purest form. You simply love to see it. And I hope we see these guys tagging again real soon. And the Nightmare family now on a three win streak defeat. The number one tag team in the tag division, Los Ingo Bernables, and now become the number one tag team to get a uh, AEW tag title shot in the Nightmare Family. Congrats to them. All right, match number four. Adam Copeland continues his climb up the AEW title division ladder on a three-win streak versus Adam Page coming off a loss to Darby Allen last week. Adam Page still ranked number two in the AEW title division. And even though Adam Copeland is on a three-win streak, 2K still has him ranked at number six. But guess what? If Adam Copeland wins this match tonight, I will change his rank manually myself. I don't know why his rank has not switched yet after three wins in a row for Adam Copeland. And uh, we'll see what will happen in this match tonight.
The ultimate opportunist, one of the most cunning superstars in WWE history. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing The Brood. From Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds, Edge! After spending eight years on the shelf in retirement, Edge has come back hungrier and tougher than ever. And his opponent from Arlington, Virginia, weighing in at 215 pounds, Adam Page. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. He cannot afford to back down. He cannot afford to question himself because he's got to know that Edge thrives in a combative environment. Guys, we have a superstar that is molded to be the next big thing. While he might be molded, he could still use a little refining. If he can harness that potential, we're looking at the next big thing. Sure, a little rough around the edges, Corey, but there's something that comes with time and experience. And we'll see what Edge has in store for him tonight. I can't imagine what sort of things Edge has already cooked up in that twisted mind of his. Yeah, Corey, sometimes it scares me how far Edge is willing to take things. We've seen how quickly Edge can snap and lose all regard for safety. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh, that forearm smash. Boom, what impact. Snap, power slam. He went right into that turnbuckle. Enough is enough. Just bludgeoning their opponent. Big boot. Vicious. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Ooh. Sometimes Edge can get a bit reckless in the ring, Corey. And we've seen that zealous nature backfire on him before. Is that going to be an issue here? While Edge's tactics seem impulsive, Cole, I can assure you, they are very well calculated. Errors can happen, but that's part of life. Edge is not reckless without reason or thought. We'll send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. This match grinded him down a little. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. 
Ah, uh, takedown. And now punches right. Oh, my goodness. Just strike it at will. It's that time. into the ring. All the way up. Oh, no. Good job. Oh. Buster. Terrible position for Edge. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. That move has brought victory before, but not on this occasion. Might be time to think outside the box. A great move into a neck breaker. Booming boot. Spear. Edge could end it there. Cover. Two count. What a kick out at two. Not about to go quietly into the night. That took some serious endurance. I'll give you that. Edge stopped just short of that mountaintop he talks about. Gonna have to make a harder push to finish things off. Jaw. Ugh, what a shot. And Edge is countered. Uncorks a thunderous shot. Edge caught him there. The master manipulator closing in on a win, maybe. And Edge, this is going to be it. Kicks out. Almost inhuman at this point. Evades the attack. Oh, man. Back to the execution. Cover. There's two. What a kick out. Oh, what a counter. We continue to see incredible perseverance from. Thwarting away the attack. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Edge now taking advantage of every opening. That very well calculated offensive edge paid off for him in spades there. Yeah. Hooked up. BT. We're undoubtedly nearing the end. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Launching. Close line. He's going for the pad. This could be it. Pin stop by rope break. Oh, ouch. I mean, he's just picking him apart now. Edge is hooked. And his opponent up. Here he comes. Reverses the move into a DDT. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's going to love this. The Doom Buster. That might just do it. Two count. He can't get it too. However you feel about Edge, you can't deny that Edge fights with every ounce of his being. What's the tally on how many times we thought this match was coming to an end? I can't. Look at that. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Jeez, take a look at Edge's face. It's a bloody canvas. Look at this crowd. It's insanity in here. Bedlam. Mitsunoku Driver. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Headed up, he's thinking back. He's positioning himself over the top rope into a limit. The opportunity for him now. Cover. Oh, kick out, kick out at two. That veteran instinct of Edge on display.
display there, digging deep into the reserves to kick out. Will that be the last opportunity? Is there still enough left in these men? The WWE Universe is on its feet. And deservedly will be landed here. He's on the road to the left. Wisely stops the count. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Over the top, right in by the Lariat. Signed, sealed, and delivered. It's a cover. Finally, it's over. Here is your winner, Adam Page. This is a big win for them here and a must win match. Unbelievable match. What an astounding effort. Pushing through exhaustion to come out on top. What a competitor. And what a great match between the two Adams. Adam Page is the one to stop. Adam Copeland's uh, win streak and defeats Adam Copeland with two beautiful buckshot larities. Congrats to Adam Page finally stopping Adam Copeland's three win streak. But Adam Copeland's rank will be corrected as deserved. All right, match number five. The rivalry war continues between Eddie Kingston and Claudio Castagnoli. Both guys playing mind games. Eddie Kingston ranked number three in the international title division and Claudio ranked number six in the international title division. Dropping a rank uh, because Eddie Kingston last week sent in, a, sent in a replacement and defeated Claudio two weeks before. Before that, Claudio had sent in a, a replacement, but Eddie Kingston came out on top, so the momentum is definitely on uh, Eddie Kingston's side in this uh, rivalry uh, war and tonight's match. So again, uh, Eddie Kingston with zero wins and uh, Claudio with one victory over Eddie Kingston. This will be their second rival battle. And finally, these guys will face off in the ring in a real match without any mind games. There's an excitement in the air. These opponents are ready to go. And not wasted any time. You can say that again. Oh, oh, oh. You had to expect this. You had to expect this level of intensity between these competitors. These two want to tear each other apart. They can't wait to get things started. No use wasting any more time. These two have reached a boiling point. Clearly a lot of hostile feelings between these superstars who couldn't even wait for the match to begin before getting their hands on each other. It takes real toughness to climb into the ring after taking a few hits. It shows how much this match means to everyone involved. Whoa! Somersault plunge out of the floor. That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. Turned inside out by the German. Saw it coming. Oh, anus knee to the face. Oh, saw it coming. He's looking a little off balance. He turns it around. Boom. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Ooh, that'll leave a mark. He got whipped into that corner. Knife edge chop. For the win. And there's the kick out. Could be a 
search of a second win now. Ooh. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. From the top. Are you kidding me? He's getting a little battered now. And he breaks the count quickly. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Stop in the leg. And he's taking on a persistent assault. Yeah, he's being faced with a lot of adversity right now. Any form of consideration seems to have left this rivalry with each passing week. When animosity runs this deep in your veins, Cole, I don't care who you are, you reach animalistic levels of desperation. Well, let's hope they can hang on to a... Time to go swinging! The king of swing! He might go all night. Tossed around like a rag doll. This could be the beginning of the end. Uh-oh. The sharpshooter is locked in. Can you imagine what it would do to his confidence if he tapped out right here, right now? It might be the... Got to find a way out of the sharpshooter. And does just that. Struggling a bit here. There's been plenty of action in this match. Oh, look at this. Is it enough, guys? Is Shot it enough to get back in this match? Wow. So far, so good. Will it be? Digging deep for a kick out. I am in shock. Here he goes for the win. And he closes it out. I pounded out at two. I can't believe it. I understand the set. with a waistlock takedown. Watch this display of power. Sit up, Powerball. Efficiency of attacks from him now. His offense is second to none at times like this. Looking to take flight here. From the top rope, beautiful drop kick. Knee straight to the gut, stays off the attack. Sharp kicks. And that could be all. Let's see. Oh, he just kicked out. Had to dig deep to break that pin. But can it be done again? How much is left after that? How draining was that? Can it be done again? Can that maneuver be summoned at least one more time? And we just saw some serious offense. Look at this. Here we go. Serious trouble here and finds his way out. Ah, uh, look at this. Oh, and the impact of the German suplex. He finds a counter. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? First up top. Still going on. 
defies all reasoning. This is truly awesome. And well-timed maneuver there. Just a dominant display. Big power slam. For the win. There's two. No. He kicks out. How does anyone kick out at this point? Shot after shot. Oh, ruthless striking. Out of the way in time. Close line. Well, that will leave a mark. Unexpected attack. Well, let's just focus on the positives here. So Eddie Kingston and Claudio Castagnoli finally face off for the second time. Claudio gets a second victory over Eddie Kingston, leading this uh, rival war. So two victories to. Eddie Kingston's zero, and they will face off next week for a third rival battle. One more victory for Claudio, and he gets a shot at that international, that AEW international title. 
All right, on to our main event and the only championship match of the night. Darby Allen ranked number one in the AEW title division versus Adam Cole, the AEW champion who defeated MJF for the title, forcing MJF to switch divisions, which is now uh, MJF moved to the TNT title division thanks to uh, Adam Cole. Darby Allen coming off a win over Adam Page last week to put him in the uh, number one seed to get that title shot tonight. So Darby Allen coming off a win versus the uh, newly crowned AEW champion and has held the title for a while. Let's see what happens tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the AWA World Championship. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. He's been undergoing a lot of training for tonight, not taking this title opportunity lightly. As a reminder, the title is on the line here in this match. And the champ is certainly going to have an uphill battle, that's for sure. The WWE Universe more than ready for this title defense, and the champion is prepared, too. Introducing the challenger from Seattle, Washington, weighing in at 175 pounds, Dirty Allen. And his opponent from Panama City, Florida, weighing in at 206 pounds. He is the AWA World Champion, Adam. That championship right there is what it's all about, gentlemen.
Here you have the championship on the line, a champion on high alert. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in store for something special. The champion into the cover. Oh, somehow. That's still a quick kick out at this point. Not the position you want to be in right now. with punches and not oh a nasty stop to finish it off oh that might have just broken something a flat out power into the scoop slam oh a solid form and he's showcasing here's the pin title on the line kick out and one for the challenger these men knew this match is going to be hard fought chance for him to get back into this match. Oh, I had that well scouted. Oh, Roundhouse connects. The challenger eating up some damage. Trap the arm. Smooth. And he is now in a discouraging spot. He's got to reevaluate his approach at this point. Oh, kick right to the face. Kick to the gut. Right around into a neck breaker. Ooh, harsh kick. Oh, man. He takes control. He's showing it's not time for lying down, it's time for fighting back. Stiff kick. Both legs trapped. Ouch! the corner. 
New champ must feel, Byron. And Darby Allen becomes new AEW champion. Congrats to Darby Allen. Adam Cole giving up a fight, of course, with a four star match. And Adam Cole will exercise his rematch clause come next week. So we'll, we will see uh, this matchup continue next week for the AEW title. But congrats to Darby Allen, the new AEW champion. Now a uh, two-division champion, former TNT champion, now AEW champion Darby Allen. And that is it for tonight, folks. Thank you for watching. We'll catch you on the next show which will be uh, WCW as the invasion wars continue between uh, Monday Night Raw and WCW. Good night. God bless.